Good morning, students. Our topic for today is about the histology of the pineal gland. The pineal gland is also known as epiphysis cerebri, which is described as small pine cone shaped organ measuring 5 to 8 millimeters by 3 to 5 millimeters in size. The pineal gland regulates the daily rhythms of bodily activities and it develops from neuroectoderm in the posterior wall of the third ventricle. It is covered by connective tissue septa of the pia mater from which septa containing blood vessel emerge which subdivide the pineal gland into variously sized lobules. The most abundant cells in the pineal gland are called pinealocytes as pointed by red arrows which are the secretory cells of the pineal gland. So these cells produce melatonin which maintains the body's circadian rhythm. Pinealocytes have slightly basophilic cytoplasm and irregular euchromatic nuclei. Since it is euchromatic nuclei, the chromatin are less dense, so nucleus stains lighter. Pinealocytes also have secretory vesicles, abundant mitochondria, and long cytoplastic processes. Melatonin release from pinealocytes is promoted by darkness and inhibited by daylight. So melatonin maintains the circadian rhythm or light and darkness cycle of the body. The pineal gland also has interstitial glial cells as pointed by red arrow in the picture that are modified astrocytes representing 5% of cells in the pineal gland. It stains positively for glial fibrillary acidic protein and these cells have elongated nuclei more heavily stained than those of pinealocytes and are usually found in perivascular areas and between the groups of pinealocytes. Another histologic structure that we need to identify in the pineal gland is the corpora arenacea as pointed by black arrow, also known as brain sand. Corpora arenacea are variously sized concretions of calcium and magnesium salts. These are actually extracellular protein deposits that mineralize. And they appear during childhood and gradually increase in size with age, with no effect on the gland's function. So the more and bigger corpora arenacea, the older the pineal gland is. These are corpora arenacea which have a known physiologic significance but an excellent histologic marker for pineal gland. Since there are a lot and bigger corpora arenacea, probably this pineal gland belongs to an older person. And now let's try to identify some structures. Identify the cells or pointed structures. If you answer corpus arenaceum or corpora arenacea if it's plural for A, pinealocyte for B, and astrocyte for C, then you get everything right. And that's the end of our lecture.